Colorful has introduced a new iGame Ultra graphics card. And this time, it includes something you don't often see, being two NVMe slots behind the GPU. Based on the size, cooling, and overall layout of this GPU, it's most likely going to be an RTX 5060, 5060 Ti, or could even be the new 5050s. GPUs like the RTX 5060 and 5060 Ti often only use eight lanes of the available 16 lanes on the motherboard. What this means is the card is only pulling eight of those lanes, leaving another eight of them available for use. By integrating two M.2s, this does then take that full slot capacity of 16 lanes usable. And this is why we see Colorful doing this with this GPU, which then takes advantage of the unused lanes to use them as storage devices without using the current slots on the motherboard, which makes this a clean solution, especially for those compact builds you got an ITX build that you're planning on doing and those don't have much slots available, this could be a solution moving forward. Now, this isn't the first time we've seen something like this. Asus did do something like this on the RTX 4060 Ti series and that only had one M.2 slot on it. But the biggest story here isn't the storage, it's more the potential. This design could be setting the stage for more advanced integration in the future. Think about this. Could you imagine them using this for GPU accelerated asset storage, direct storage feeding directly into the VRAM, low latency between game files and renderings, heck, even maybe potentially in the future, bypassing the CPU and RAM and doing everything localized on the GPU. The groundwork's already being laid. Games are getting heavier, more texture driven, more massive, and real-time data streaming becoming more and more of a thing. If we see direct storage being coupled into GPUs like we are currently, we could potentially see GPUs becoming full compute units able to store and run your games directly off the graphics card which could make the requirements of running games come down in terms of hardware like CPUs and RAM. Colorful's implementation on this GPU might seem simple. However, the idea behind this does make a lot of sense, especially when we are facing less and less features on lower end motherboards and people might need some extra M.2 slots available. Let me know in the comments, would you use the storage on your GPU if you had it like this? And where do you see this trend moving in the future?